Welcome here. Uh, may I know your name, please? Thank you. This is Sharon Mr. Dina Convention. So, where do you live? Currently, I am living at Vinatur, Russia, which is quite convenient for me. Okay. So, why do you want to appear for IITS examination? Actually, I have found you to uh, conduct my higher studies in abroad. That's why, for pursuing my scholarship, I am participating in IIT exam. Okay, so how many family members in your family? Uh, actually, I live with my mom, dad, and me. I don't have any siblings. Okay, so what do you study in history lessons when you were at school? I vividly remember whenever I was a child, I came to uh, read history because from history book, I became able to know about our past histories. That's why I think history is quite interesting. Okay. Did you enjoy studying history at school? Yeah, certainly. I love to study history because from the history book, uh, I can gather a lot of information, which is quite important. On top of that, if I want to visit an historical place, those information uh, help me a lot. Okay. How often do you watch TV programs about history now? Well, uh, as uh, due to my hectic uh, schedules, nowadays I don't get enough time for watching history program. But I love to watch history program whenever I get time. What period in history do you like to learn more about? Actually, uh, I love to watch uh, history programs. Uh, I don't have big choice. Uh, most often, I love to watch uh, the past histories of medieval centuries, and those are quite uh, mesmerizing for me. And I get a lot of information from those centuries. Okay, now it's time for part two. Uh, here is your cue card. You can get one minute for. and Kushtia is my hometown which is situated beside the river Gorai. I have spent all of my childhood in this city. The city is good to live. On top of that, the neighbors of my surrounding places is uh, quite good. Most of them um, are service older. My father is also a service older and I have seen that most of my surroundings uh, are from this background. Uh, however, there are other professional uh, people who lived uh, in my neighborhood. Among them, my uh, two families are doctor family and uh, other sort of uh, people like teachers and businessmen also live there. Uh, I vividly remember about, about my next door neighbor uh, who was a doctor. Uh, he was quite friendly. Uh, her name was Mrs. Jamil and uh, he had two kids. I used to play with those kids. Uh, I can remember that uh, the girl's name was Joya and the boy's name was Jim. Uh, we, are, we are a good friend. I have spent a, a great moment with them. Moreover, the relationship with my families to, with the, the neighborhood was great. Actually, they were like our kid and kid in every uh, occasion like Eid and Pujas, we were we invited all of the people. Sometimes we go, we went to the their house for having teas. Uh, one important thing, thing I want to mention that one of aunt, one of my aunt who lived in the neighborhood, I was fond of her cooking because she had good culinary activities and he made uh, uh, cake quite good. Actually, it was mouth watering. Whenever I get uh, got chance to have it, I always try to have this cake, and it was a great time indeed. Uh, sometimes uh, we made a plan for going picnic. All of uh, with all of the surroundings, we made picnic every year. 
uh, one important moment I I want to mention that uh, one time I we have made a picnic in Shahjadpur uh, uh, and it was a great moment indeed. Uh, however, if I get a chance, I will love to live with them. Though I know it's not possible because most of them had had changed their locations. But if I get this chance, uh, I would feel the over the moon, and it will it would be a great moment for me. And I think uh, good neighbors are also blessings, and as we have, we can share our sorrows and sufferings with them. And it is a great time to spend with the neighbors. And I think uh, neighbors are good. Okay. Now let's start part three. What sort of things can neighbors do to help each other? Well, neighbors have a great role in our daily life. Actually, they become our integral part. We can share our views sometimes if we are in need of some things like small things uh, from our kitchens or emergency help at night. They can provide those kind of help. Uh, on top of that, if a neighbor is a doctor, it becomes a blessing. Uh, in the night time, when we feel sick, they may help us. And considering all of th those things, I think uh, neighbors are also our good friend in it. How well do people generally know their neighbors in your country? Uh, to be honest, uh, my country people are quite friendly and they love to make relationship with their neighbors. Though uh, due to the civilization uh, nowadays, uh, the urban people uh, don't have much relationship with their neighbors. But uh, uh, in my in my city, the people love to keep in touch with their neighbors. They usually go to their neighbors for uh, being introduced, and uh, they take care of them. Uh, and vice versa, the neighbors also come to their home and make a good relationship. How important do you think it is to have good neighbors? Certainly, it's quite important because uh, without a good neighbor, it, our lives become next to impossible. We, uh, we couldn't think of a good day. If the neighbors are not uh, good or polite men, uh, we have to face a lot of struggle. Sometimes they make quarrel and we, the environment of uh, the place in which we are living uh, become, uh, become quite bad because uh, we are living in a society and good relationships among the uh, participants uh, in uh, around us is quite important. The next question is, which facilities are most important to people living in cities? Well, in our cities, uh, we are in need of several facilities like uh, we must have good uh, water service because water is quite important and in the cities we generally get water from a supply system. If there is no uh, water supply system, then it would be uh, it would be great hazard for most of the people because water is quite important for our life. Secondly, I I recommend that uh, good environment or good relationship with the neighbor is a uh, is a must uh, because we are living in some of the people. If they are not good minded one, then uh, we become actually bored or sometimes we feel uh, anxious. How often shopping is small uh, small local shops differ from shopping in large city center shop? Yeah, there are tremendous difference between the city center shop or shopping in a local market or local market. I think uh, in the city, city center market, we can get uh, a lot of things within a short period of time. But the uh, most important thing is that most of the uh, uh, products cost is quite high. Uh, most of the people are not able to buy those. On the free side, if we want to get uh, something uh, at a cheap rate from the small market, we can have this. However, it actually depends on the personal the person's choice that uh, they would go to the uh, big market or super shop or the local market. Do you think that children should always go to school nearest to by the way? No, certainly not. I don't think so. Actually, I suggest that parents should uh, take their children to a famous or recognized schools where they can uh, learn 
non important things which is important for their life if we fix up that we will send our children to the school uh, that is quite close to us the most often the school may not be good enough that's why i think we should not be fixed or adamant in this issue. thank you